Unit 8 technique. We're following through here more on imitation. Let's explore imitation with this imitative study. We have a left hand subject or motif, we could call it either one, a melody if you will. Stepwise motion and it's imitated in the other hand. And then imitated higher now. Notice the second half wasn't stepwise motion, it was skips. Either way, we imitate. We not only are imitating the pitches, but you can also imitate the expression. We want to go. Notice the little swell soft to loud. Maybe we go soft to here and imitate softly here or loudly. So explore this concept of imitation with the sound, pitches, and dynamics, and also see if you can use imitation in some different keys. We did this based on our C pentascale. What if we did something a little brave here and just move it up a step here to D? Now we can explore this. Quite a different sound. And do we have to be restricted just to the octaves as given? Hey, we could play in any position we want, right? In other words, let's go back as written to C, but instead of starting here, I'm gonna start low. And I'm going to imitate high. Imitation is a tool of the composer. Make it a tool for your practice and your own creative exploration.